everyone, it's Joe here from GeoWarm Security. Today I'd like to show you guys how to program in a Honeywell 5898 motion slash temperature sensor into an L7000. Alright, so on the sensor on the top, you're going to notice a serial number. Just write down that serial number. And also, there's the bracket to open it. You just depress that and it pops right open. Now, you're going to notice on here, there's a bunch of dip switches here, and there's a sensitivity here. So you need to make sure whatever application you're using it for that you see in the manual what to set these to. All right, so we're doing this for a motion sensor, so we're going to set it up as loop one. And we're going to set our dip switches accordingly. After you have all those set, you're going to put your cover back on. And then we're going to get into programming on our panel. In order to get into programming on these, you're going to hit more, tools, 4112, which is the default installer code. Program, zones, and we're going to pick the first zone, which is zone 2. You're going to edit, and over here is where your serial number is going to go. After you have your serial number in, you're going to hit done. Now for this device, well, for any device, you need to make sure you have your loop number correct. So you just need to look and see, like I said before, it's going to be a loop one. So we're going to leave that as is. For the device type, we're going to switch this to a motion sensor. And then wherever it was going to go, your description you can put in. Otherwise, if that was it and you're done, you save it. If you had any other zones to add, this would be where you would do it, zone three, four, so on and so forth. Uh, but that's all we're going to do for now. So you're going to return, return. Very important, always yes, to allow installer to re-enter programming. Otherwise, you may have a hard time, you will have a hard time getting back into programming. All right, so that is how to install a Honeywell 5898 motion slash temperature sensor into an L7000. Any questions or comments down below? Otherwise, give us a call at one eight seven seven geo geoarm I'm sorry, one eight seven seven four 4 geoarm or visit us on our website at www.geoarm.com. Thank you.